Good evening and thanks for joining us. There was a packed house tonight for the Vigo County Area Planning Meeting. That's because many people living in Prairieton showed up to oppose a Dollar General store coming to their neighborhood. Dollar General wants to put a store near Kennett Drive and Highway 63. News since Jackson Plank was at that meeting tonight. He joins us now in our studio to share how it all went down. Tonight, a representative for Dollar General went before the Area Planning Commission. Dollar General's goal was to have the commission rezone their land from agriculture to commercial use. However, a vote from the group was delayed after many residents spoke in opposition of the proposal. The community of Prairieton showed up in full force on Wednesday. One by one, community members got up to express their disapproval. We, the residents of Prairieton, Indiana, are deeply concerned about the proposed construction of a Dollar General store in our peaceful rural residential area. Local resident Cindy Morgan told commission members that a Dollar General would take away from the things that make the area unique. We believe that preserving the character of our residential community should take precedence <clears throat> over commercial um, expansion. Residents living in the area shared concerns about what impact they believe the national chain store would do to their area. Those concerns included things like lowering property values and increased traffic and crime. Residents who spoke pointed out that there are already Dollar Generals close by. We don't need another Dollar General so close to us. We need homes, and this land would be better suited for adding neighbors, not a discount chain store. However, Lou Britton, an attorney representing the chain, later rebuted some of their claims. He told the crowd it is not the job of the Area Planning Commission to pick and choose businesses. The Area Planning Commission is not supposed to say, oh, well, you're a small family-owned business, so you're okay. You're not a small family-owned business, so we don't want you. In the end, residents were not able to dissuade the commission. The commission voted 9-1 to one toward a favorable recommendation in favor of Dollar General's request. The Vigo County Commissioners will now have to approve Dollar General's request that is scheduled to happen next Tuesday at 9 a.m. Back to you.